Boxing Voice. Also, uh, I know you've worked with Stan, the man, Mari Noyek. Uh, he's in Pacquiao's training camp. Do you think Pacquiao is going to get um, good work um, to prepare for Algeria? Do you think that that, what's your thoughts on that? I thought that was actually a good call from the Pacquiao camp uh, using Stan because he just kind of resembles Algieri, you know what I'm saying? Not only the way he fights, you know what I'm saying? Just the, the look of him and everything is kind of, kind of. I think Algieri's a little bit more slippery and slick with his with his movement, but it's still kind of like the same look. And you want to get used to looking at that, looking at that man. Excuse me. You want to get used to looking at that man. You know, uh, get the closest thing you can to him. But Stan is good work. You know what I'm saying? He's good work. I worked with him a while ago. And anytime you want that big boy work, Stan, come holla at your boy because you'd be working with these little guys. I'm that big boy work. But, um, yeah, man, Stan is good work. That's my man right there. Uh, so I heard that you were supposed to fight on a top-ranked card that was headlined by Jose Ramirez. Yeah, I'm going to cut you off. These motherfuckers called Eddie the Croft, the magician, you know what I'm saying? He called, uh, I guess he was trying to give me a fight, right? So he hit up top rank. I guess they had some guy named Barbosa. We was trying to get the fight. They told Eddie they wasn't looking for a southpaw. But then they acquired about another southpaw trying to get the fight. So evidently, they didn't want this 420. They didn't want the Kush. You know what I'm saying? So what they did was they went and bought some Reggie for all you wee heads out there instead of fucking with that grade A. You know what I'm saying? And that's cool. But just say that. Just say that to my culture. You know what? We're not trying to go in that direction right now. We want to, you know, we want to, you know, get another. We want to get. We're trying to go in another direction. Because if you get in there, I'm going to get you up out of there. Whether it's a stoppage, whether I knock you out cold, it, it, unanimous, unanimous decision, you're still going to come out of there with, with a loss and beat the hell up. So, I mean, it, it, it's up to them, man. But they ain't, they ain't really trying to fight me. So, I ain't really surprised, you know. I fucked up my thumb and shit, sparring. Trying to hit somebody with that smoke left. Fucking slipped it. No. Hit my thumbs. It, it ain't like broke, it's like bruised or something. That shit hurt though, but it's good. Then my middle finger been bothering me. Too much smoke. I need to start wearing my bigger gloves. Warm my hand up. That's my fighter, Muhammad. He ain't here trying to you know, get strong. I'm saying we about to just do a couple little reps. I don't like this bench. I can't get my hands where they need to be. Sometimes I might get bored. They be telling me stop lifting, but I don't care. <sighs> Quick rep five. We always drop down and do push ups in between. Boxing voice.